in South Carolina and hundreds of black conservatives getting together in the capital city, pushing to restore the American dream. That's the theme of their annual event. They invited former President Donald Trump to speak at their annual awards gala. The Republican hopeful making his last bid to Palmetto State voters before those polls open at 7 in the morning. Our Kiana Jordan uh, is there at the convention center where uh, that pitch was just made and that speech just ended. Brian, there was a lot of support and excitement right here in this room for Donald Trump. And he just wrapped up that speech moments ago, as you can see all of the people leaving. He had a very simple message for voters, and that was that Democrats are ruining the country. And he also had a very specific message for black voters, and he promised to fight like never before for the African-American community. A number of black conservatives received rewards, including Ben Carson, Trump's former secretary of housing and urban development. President Donald Trump spoke about how an influx of undocumented people is harm is doing harm to the country, keeping men out of women's sports and bringing black voters back to the Republican Party. Trump says black Americans saw the largest increase in home ownership under his presidency. He says he also secured record amounts of funding for HBCUs during his administration. And he accused Biden of being a racist, raising inflation, and says he's the cause of a 50% increase in poverty among black Americans. I think it's the most important election. I used to say it about 2016, and I meant it. But 2016 was nothing compared to what we're going through right now. We're laughed at all over the world. People think we're, they can't believe it. We're like, we've become a joke. We've become a joke. We're being laughed at. We have no... They don't respect our leader. How can you respect the guy? He can't put two sentences together. Republicans are expecting one million people to come out and cast their ballots on Saturday. The polls are open from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. Live at the Columbia Metropolitan Convention Center, I'm Kiana Jordan. Watch Fox News Local First.